Welcome back. I'm Stacy, and I am delighted to be in this ocean of poinsettias with its performance of beautiful, colorful petals. And I'm happy to have Kelly here with me. Except Stacy, I don't think it's pronounced poinsettia. It's poinsettia. I thought I was happy to have Kelly here with me. So, <laughs> so wait, you're saying that the plant that I'm doing the entire video on, I'm pronouncing wrong? Poinsettia. Poinsettia. There's no T. But there's see two T's in not right here. Oh, so I'm saying point exactly. Oh, and then point there's yeah. Oh, and then I A. I A at the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, um, Miss Pronunciation Police, do you carry that with you everywhere? Everywhere I go. Oh. <laughs> all right, Kelly. That's not weird at all. I'm glad you think so. Yeah. So, um, you know, just curious, Kelly. Do you happen to know where point setias come from? I actually don't. Oh, you don't? How funny. I happen to. They happen to come from Mexico. Oh, cool. Do you know when they came over to America and who brought them over? I don't, but I bet you do. Oh, yes, I do <laughs> happen to know that. 1828 by a gentleman named Joel Poinsett. Oh, right? Figure. Yeah, so, so, yeah. <laughs> but on, on a lighter note, really why we're here is to talk about these gorgeous holiday flowers poinsettias, and I will agree, poinsettia really sounds more beautiful for such a beautiful holiday plant. I agree. What I really want to talk about is I think a lot of people don't know that there are several different varieties of poinsettias. We kind of know the traditional ones, right? Mm -hmm. You've got the red there. Yeah. This is the traditional white, and they're gorgeous, and they adorn many people's homes during mm -hmm. the holidays, and they are stunning. But there are some other varieties that I'm really fond of. This is one of my favorite ones. Mm -hmm. They're called Poinsettia oh, Poinsettias. Uh, try saying so, that 10 times fast. Yes, that's, <laughs> that's a tough one. Okay, so this actually happens to be a white one. I love that. Yeah, see, what I love about it, it's a little more compact than the traditional Poinsettias. Um, it's got more dense bracts. Mm -hmm. Kelly, did you also know these are not technically flowers? I these did are not. actually bracts. The flowers are the small little parts in the center of those oh, racks. Good to know. Yeah. So um, so this is the Poinsettia poinsettia poinsettias mm -hmm. are covered with um, a dense color and they're a little more compact and they come in different colors. You happen to have yes, the red one. The red one, right? I love that it has sort of this almost like white tip on the oh, edge. It's so I, pretty. Which I didn't actually notice that before. And then here's the pink one, which is really like kind of a hot pink yeah, and really stunning. stunning. Yeah, the colors on the princetias are very, very vibrant. Very. Yeah, and the flower, the bracts mm -hmm. are dense. See, I have to catch myself too. Um, then there's another one that's really different. This one is called a winter rose. Mm. And if you take a look, what it is, it's actually a double curled bract. Yeah, that one, the shape of them are so different from other point sizes. That's right. why I like that one. So it really does look like a rose. It does stay a little bit more compact. And apparently, the color lasts longer in the winter rose variety. We like so that. that's another really unique one. Now, this falls in the traditional family of poinsettias, but it is new. I actually have a big, a big sample of it here. This is gorgeous. I know it kind of looks like a traditional poinsettia, but this is called Alaska. So the white of it is going to be more of a pure white color. But also take a look at the leaves, Kelly. Do you notice anything different? Yeah, they're almost holly shaped. Yeah. I like it. They're a little bit more cut like an oak leaf or a holly leaf. So that's also a really unique variety that we're carrying this year. This is new for us and I think is really stunning. But not to be outdone, we don't want the traditional poinsettias to be outdone mm -hmm. because there are a lot of really neat colors in them. I think you have the burgundy there. Oh, I know. If you could show everybody that. It's so pretty. Yeah. How deep and rich it is. Yeah, and really deep, dark green, mm -hmm. sort of velvety leaves, which I love. Mm -hmm. And then you have a pink and white variety there that's really nice, really different, kind of not yeah. traditional. I know. Right? So if you want something unique, and this is a cinnamon one, which is really, really nice as well. So there's Colors of poinsettias to go in anybody's home. I think also this is a really neat one. That, that is that splash or something. What is that one I called? I think this I one is glitter. That's glitter. So that one. And the colors, as we go along, guys, those colors are going to get more and more vibrant through the holiday season. Mm -hmm. So you say potato. I say potato. I prefer tomato, tomato, Stacey. All right. Poinsettia, poinsettia. The point is, is they are gorgeous and there is a really nice variety for anybody to fit anybody's home. Agreed. Thanks a bunch. See you next time.